Joe started out uh, five and zero, oh, looking good, and then uh, punched two two on through. How'd you feel up this morning? Yeah, good start to the morning. You know, gotta love the guys' effort going out there, trying to score points, getting after guys, and got a lot of wins today. So that's a very positive start to the day. Uh, you know, a couple guys losing now, and and but Graf wrestled so hard and was you know again real close to getting it. Love the pace he wrestles with, and Pat had those two big wins in his last one. You know, I think he got a little frustrated, was chasing the guy more than he should have probably, and uh, I think that kind of affected him a little bit. But definitely, you know, love the, the effort those guys put forward for the, for their team and for themselves. And it, was, it was good. You see Kyle go down three nothing. Kind of what goes what goes through your head? Nothing. I figured he was all right. I knew. You know, that guy's a very dangerous wrestler, yeah. and, and Kyle was ready for a lot of his tricks and. I think he made adjustments as the match went on and, and had some great explosive finishes and uh, very pleased to see him. But yeah, I've seen him get behind before, but he's going to keep coming after you. So it, it, yeah, I wasn't too nervous yet. I guess if it was later in the match, maybe I'd start panicking, but that early, I, it wasn't a big concern. Kyle so, Dick just kind of did Kyle Dick things, huh? Yeah, interesting. I put on the shot clock twice and chasing the guy everywhere and kept getting warned over and over and over again. It didn't make a lot of sense, but... He was, I think, in control of that match and, and just like, well, I got to do something different because they're not going to help me out at all and they're going to let him do what, it, you know, they're going to try and let him do what he wants to do. And, and uh, so he, he went out and he had to earn it. He went out and chased the points and, and, then, and did a great job, I thought. So Dake and Snyder have both been here before. Snyder's been here like five times at this point. Uh, what do they need to do in the semifinals to punch through and make it just to the Just be who they are. You know, Kyle Dake, I think he's... He's, a, such, he's like a mad scientist when I watch him practice. He's like, he's trying to figure out the sport. He spends a lot of time, I think, trying to figure things out, and he's kind of taking it to another level, and I, I love watching that with him. And, and Kyle, you know, he's a great wrestler next round, and it's going to be a dogfight. But, you know, if you got to get in a foxhole with somebody, I bet you get in a foxhole with Kyle Snyder because he's the right guy to be in there with. So, you know, be who they are and, and go out there and, and fight as hard as they can for six minutes. Good things will happen. Uh, whatever happens, you know, it'll be it'll be good to see if they go out and get their best effort. Joe, what did you uh, think of the way Tyler Graff performed? A couple of big wins and then a... No, his pace, yeah, his tonight. pace was great. You know, I loved his pace and the way he was attacking guys and he was just super solid today. You know, that match he lost there, I, you know, I would have loved him chase a couple more angles there when he had those front headlocks and, you know, he was right there to win it at the end and, and uh, very, very impressed with, with his effort. And, I'm really hoping that guy pulls him back through because, uh, you know, the pace he's setting is, is, is fun to watch. What do you think about the atmosphere? This place is filling up the last couple days. Yeah, I was getting nervous out there, and I wasn't <laughs> even on the mat. I was way in the back, but it was getting loud when Kazakhstan was on the mat and Russia's on the mat. It's like, mm, it's going to be interesting when we wrestle those guys. So it's, it's a great atmosphere. You got to, you know, what they're doing here, they're putting on a really good tournament, and I and, uh, really appreciate their hospitality. and. And getting the fans in here to support the guys, it makes it more fun for the guys competing. Even if they're booing for you, it's good, right? Or I guess they whistle over here. So. Yeah. We want them to whistle a lot tonight, so that's probably a good thing for us. Thanks, Joe. Yeah. Hey, where's